Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Gold. In the last episode, we completed the Pokemon League and became the champion of the Johto and or Kanto region. So, we are the Pokemon champion and, well, this is the post game. I don't know if you could call it that, but, well, this is the, this is the episode where we're going to go into the Kanto region. I know we've been into the Kanto region before, but we're going to start going into towns and battling gym leaders and such, doing all of the cool Kanto stuff. But first, I, I want to tell my mom that I was made the Pokemon champion. She'll be so proud of me. Huh? A phone call. Hey, it's Professor Elm. Hello, Thrash. I have something here for you. Could you swing by my lab? See you later. Oh, I guess I'll go talk to Professor Elm. He more probably wants to congratulate me as well. I am the strongest trainer in, in the region. Mom, Mom, I, I beat the Pokemon League. I beat the champion. I'm the new Pokemon champion. I'm a Pokemon master, and I'm only 10 years old. Hi, welcome. You're, ve you're trying very hard, I see. Yes, I did try very hard, and... It paid off. I'm the Pokemon champion. I'd get your room tidy. Um, okay, that's nice. Uh, I guess you dusted or whatever. There's not much really that could be done in there. If a room is not being lived in. But anyways, I'm the Pokemon champion. Don't you, don't you want to say say congratulations or something, Mom? Or is this about your money? It's always money with you, Mom. It's always money. Why is it always about the money? No, it's not about the money. Do you want to switch to daylight savings time? That doesn't even make sense. Well, what do you? Who do you think you are? Father time or Mother Nature or something? You can't just switch it to daylight savings time whenever you feel like it. That's not the way that time works. Oh, this is the last time I come home and talk to you. Just do what you can. Yeah, whatever. Just just go keep my room tidy or whatever you do. Oh, my mom is such a ditz, I swear. Okay, let's go see what Elm wanted. Maybe he'll have something useful. <laughs> oh, that poor, poor Totodile. No love. Thrash, there you are. I, I called you because I have something for you. Ooh, you always give me good stuff. See, it's an SS ticket. SS ticket? Now you can catch Pokemon in Kanto. Ooh, the complete other region. Well, I guess I could technically... Yeah, there is grass on the way to the Pokemon League, but not much. Thrash received the SS ticket. Thrash put the SS ticket in the key eyes pocket. This ship departs from Olivine City, but you knew that already, Thrash. Um, I actually did. Practice file, you know. After all, you traveled all over with your Pokemon. I did. Give me your regards to give my regards to Professor Oak in Kanto. All right, he, he lives in Pallet Town, right? I'll I'll go I'll go talk to him. All right, so now we have the SS ticket, and I'm done with my idiots in my hometown. So, wow, I think this is the first time I've actually used Fly as an HM. Well, as you can see, uh, the little the uh, icon is a bat because we're using night to fly and I think that's a nice touch they didn't really do that in the other in any games after this but then again in the third gen every Pokemon had their own individual sprite so that would be kind of difficult to do although I guess they did do some kind of like thing anyways um, uh, we need to go to Olivine City is this one here near the near the water which makes sense because we're getting on a boat and look, this is cool. We actually the overworld sprite for for a bat actually comes up and flies around. Oh, and if you didn't realize, all of our Pokemon ha have been completely healed. That's uh, that uh, Pokemon Champion thingy was also also healed our Pokemon because I think it. I'm pretty sure that thing was a gutted uh, po Pokemon Center healing machine, just completely remodified for uh, making champions, or, well, registering champions. Anyways, uh, this is where we go to the SS ticket. Welcome to the fast ship SS Aqua. Will you be boarding today? Yes, sir. 
May I see your SS ticket, sir? Here you go. Flash, uh, flash the SS ticket. That's it. Thank you, sir. All right. Thank you very much. We're departing soon. Please get on board. Okay. So here we are on the SS Aqua. And the ship is leaving. We're on our way to Kanto. So, well, whoa. Whoa. Excuse me, son. I was in a hurry. My granddaughter is missing. She's just a wee girl. If you see her, please let me know. Well, okay. I'll, I'll keep an eye out for your little girl. Anyways, uh, this place is a lot nicer than the SSN because we actually get our own room. Here's your cabin. If your Pokemon are hurt, take a nap in the bed. That will heal them. Yep. We come in here, and this place is basically a Pokemon Center. I mean, we go into here, a comfy bed, time to sleep. It makes a little jingle, and uh, we're all healed up. Here is a PC in case we want to, like, switch out Pokemon or items or whatever, or check the Hall of Fame. <laughs> yeah, we can... This is pretty much the Hall of Fame. It just shows you what level and stuff your Pokemon, or, and what exact Pokemon you used to fight the Elite Four. So, that's in the PC. You can check that anytime you want. Yeah, this is basically just just a Pokemon Center without Nurse Joy. Uh, so, it's really nice to be able to come back here. Because there are a lot of trainers on this boat, and I'm going to be showing a few of them. Oh, also, I'd like to point out my brand new sidebars. Made those myself. I thought it was appropriate. We're past the we're past the the Johto part of the game, and we're on our way to Kanto. So, well, I thought I give up. I thought I make some new Kanto sidebars, and well, I've got some ideas uh, how I'm going to handle the gym leaders. Uh, all right, so um, let's start fighting some dudes. Uh, who's who's the front? Oh yeah, both because I needed to take out Lance's Gyarados. Uh, I think I'll put Seed in the front. Seed is pretty low level. Okay. So, yeah, I'm going to be showing a few of these fights because, well, I just need to show off being champion. I mean, I, I do like this area because these Pokemon, these well, these trainers have some relatively weak Pokemon uh, compared to you, at least. I mean, if you even just squeaked by beating the Elite Four, then you're still going to be legions above these Pokemon. And with the diversity of, of your team, uh, you'll be able to... You've already beaten the game and you know what's what. And they're just giving you some weak trainers just, just to make you feel good. Just to make you, like... Just to make you feel like the champion. Like, you're just completely wiping the floor with everybody on this, on this stupid boat. It makes you feel so powerful and empowering. I do like the SS Aqua section. Just... I don't know, that's what it speaks to me. It just makes you feel powerful as the champion. And it's just so good. I do like it. And, well, we've pretty much passed the hard part of the game. Um, there's only really, like, one more difficult part, and that's, like, the super ultra secret special secret boss that's at the end of the game, but that's way past. That's, that's not for a while. Hello, son. I can't find my granddaughter. If she's on the ship, that's okay, but what if she fell overboard? She's an energetic child, so she may be bugging someone. I'm worried. Oh, well, I, I guess you have a right to be worried. Uh, this is the guy whose daughter he lost. Oh, hello, person. The passengers are all trainers. They're all itching to battle in their cabins. Alright. Hey, let's see what's downstairs. Maybe we'll find the engine room or something. Oh, there's nothing really here. Oh, sailor. Wh huh? Well, what's up, bro? <laughs> hey, guy. Could I get you to look for my buddy? He's goofing off somewhere, that lazy bum. I want you to go find him. So, so I'm... But I'm on duty right now. Wait. I, I understand that, but why are you making me a random passenger do it? Eh, fine. I'll, I'll help you out. I'm a good guy. I'll help you find your buddy. Okay, but I'm, I'm gonna battle some trainers in the meantime. I hope you're not in, like, a hurry. Uh, Alright. I don't know. I just... I do like the SS Aqua section. I mean... 
it's just a lot better than the SSN because you you have a room where you can sleep, so you don't have that tension of the deli bird. It looks all ugh, it looks like it's got a giant like forehead in this game. Whatever. Um, in this game, but uh, the SS Aqua it's so much better than the SSN because because of the Pokemon Center room. I mean. You don't have that tension of, oh, my Pokemon PP is running out just because I've been beating all these people. I need... You can just go over there, take a nap, and bada bing, bada boom, your Pokemon are all fine again. And if your Pokemon gets hurt, which I doubt it would, because not really any of these Pokemon... Not, none of these trainers are really a threat to you if you've beaten Lance, and Lance is the only way you could have gotten here. So... Oh, in the door, Anyways, yeah, this this place it's just to make you feel like the champion, and you do feel like the champion. That's what. That's one of the reasons I think they put they they made Kanto so easy, because through Johto, you're you're only a ten year old kid, and you're just fighting the odds, trying to make it, trying to make it past all of these uh, gym trainers, but. You've proven yourself as the Pokemon champion. You are a Pokemon master, and thus you were strong enough to beat all of the, the Kanto gym leaders while holding three Pokeballs behind your back. I mean, honestly. <laughs> I even did consider uh, switching it up a bit and, like, maybe only taking one or two Pokemon to, f to fight each gym trainer, but uh, I find that to be problematic and uh, it might get annoying. And I just kind of want to feel like I'm like I'm powerful, feel like the champion, and just just fight everybody easily. Oh, I believe this guy's a fire type user. Oh well, I can still take him out with my ice type because my ice type is also a ground type. I am not going to switch out to Slappy. Screw you. I am going to use earthquake on all of your things. Whoa ha 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 ha! Take that fire breather. I'm taking out with a with a ice type. A type that you're supposed to be good against. What's wrong with you? I know what. Nothing's wrong with you. It's just something that's right with me. I'm the champion, don't you know? You probably didn't hear it happened like 20 minutes ago, but I'm the new champion, so. Like, bow to me or something. Ha! Huh, you should have used a fire type. Pro tip for a pro trainer. I'm the champion, don't you know? <laughs> also, I love gloating to NPCs, which. Honestly, is kind of sad, but anyways, uh, coughing. Yeah, he he's a fire type user, and he's only really got one fire type Pokemon. He's got poison types. What's with poison types? Honestly, I mean, can't there be a type of trainer that just uses specific poison types? I mean, besides Rocket. Then again, Rocket's just idiots with their standard issue Radita. All right, Lyle. Uh, we, but we still gotta find that guy, that guy's friend, and that little girl. But I guess we'll do some searching in the next episode. I'm going to take a nap, and next time we will we'll find some people and just run around on the ship and just be an asshole to people some more. But because I have a right, because I am the Pokemon champion of the Johto and Orkanto region. This is me, champion of the Johto and Orkanto region, Thrasho2, saying, Be cool, save often, and don't do anything I wouldn't. <laughs>